We're encouraging kids to become referees, not just in soccer. So we got to help them out, not scare them away. Quebec soccer leaders and clubs are denouncing an attack on a 17-year-old referee at a youth soccer game, bringing it to a halt. On May 7th in Dollar des Ormeaux on Montreal's West Island. The incident was filmed and posted to social media. It shows a spectator coming down from the bleachers to confront the referee. Seemingly visibly frustrated, the man puts himself in the teen's face. The teen pushes the man off of him before getting punched in the face by the spectator. The man was then tackled to the ground by others in attendance. It was a good soccer game. No violence on the field. It was a clean game. It was a 1-1 game. The kids were having a blast on the field. And this, this just came out of left field. It was unexpected. It happened during the opening game of the summer season between U14 Saint Laurent and Au Richelieu. I was shocked. How could it happen in uh, in 2022 uh, in, in our society? The spectator who attacked the referee is said to be a 72-year-old man who was there to support his grandson playing for Saint Laurent. The man apparently took issue with the linesman. They had some bickering back and forth. And then one thing led to another, and in the span of five seconds, all hell broke loose. Police were not called to the scene at the time of the incident, and the teen was seen walking off after the punch. But Soccer Quebec encourages the young official to seek justice. A source City News spoke to close to the victim confirms he is now doing well. The teen and his family are exploring their options on whether to make a formal complaint and whether he wants to continue being an official. We forget it's a youth sport, it's a matter sport. And the referee uh, are there, they, they learn, they made uh, mistakes, players too made mistakes. A couple of people doesn't accept those errors. On Tuesday, the 72-year-old grandfather sent a letter to the Saint Laurent Soccer Club apologizing to the teen and his family, as well as the players, coaches and other match officials. He said, I behaved in an unacceptable way and I take responsibility for it. Rest assured that I deeply regret it. As a former teacher, I am particularly aware that this is a very bad example for 14-year-olds. He added, I am extremely saddened by the situation and the consequences it has had for so many people, including my family members. I am aware that many may have been shocked or hurt by my actions, and I ask their forgiveness. The sanction is, is heavy, where he won't be able to ever watch his grandkid play soccer in our club ever again, which is kind of sad, right? The Saint Laurent Soccer Club says it'll launch an internal campaign to prevent this kind of violence from happening in the future. Our message can be loud and clear, uh, whether it's putting um, you know banners at games, at practices, Constant messages were unacceptable. We're here for the kids. In Montreal, Alicia Rubertucci, City News.